Hello friends, welcome back and in this new episode I'm going to review uh, Vizal Dahab from the house of Ajmal. So first of all, let's talk about the presentation. You will get this perfume in this beautiful golden and uh, brown box. A simple but decent and elegant box. And now let me show you the bottle. And bottle is very unique. So here this is. This is a very famous perfume. I'm sure you have seen this bottle a lot of times. So here is the bottle and the cap here is uh, made of metal but it's very light and here you will get this uh, glass portion here showing you the color of juice and name of the perfume on the both sides a uh, decent beautiful and nice looking bottle very unique so this was about the presentation and now let's talk about the scent or the fragrance so let me give you the notes breakdown first and then i will try to explain you how this perfume actually smells uh, so in the top you will get green apple peach pear grapefruit and mandarin and then in the mid north you will get rose jasmine orchid and geranium and then in the base you will get sandalwood cedarwood patchouli and musk so now let's talk about the fragrance or the scent so as you can see in the notes breakdown there are a lot of fruits in the top and then there are a lot of florals in the mid and uh, woody and musky notes in the base uh, very nice combination uh, straightforward uh, very beautiful and nice concoction so in the opening the most prominent fruits i can get are apple and pear and of course uh, some hints of other fruits but it's not citrusy i don't get any citrus as they have mentioned the note of grapefruit uh, but i was not able to get any grapefruit or any citrus not in the opening yeah but what you will get is a very strong note of apple and pear and then you will get a lot of damascena rose with a little bit uh, hints of uh, orchid jasmine and then a lot of musk so these are the main players in this perfume and then you will also get uh, some nuances of jasmine and geranium uh, but they are very light in the middle, very faint, but you will start getting them once you give it a proper and regular uh, wearings. And then along with jasmine and geranium, you will also get a little bit more prominent as compared to these two notes, a little bit more prominent uh, orchid. Orchid is a little bit more prominent as compared to jasmine and geranium. Geranium you cannot get in this perfume because of a rose, a lot of damascena rose and because geranium also smells like rose so it's very difficult to uh, detect it but once uh, your nose will mature uh, and as you give this perfume a lot more wearings and you let it develop on you you will start getting this nice uh, uh, light nuances of geranium and then you will get a note of sandalwood in the base but again it's very subtle very soft and very calm uh, so this was the scent profile and uh, once this perfume starts developing on you and once it starts moving towards its dry down you will left with two most prominent things and that are uh, damascena rose and musk and a little bit of sandalwood in the base so this was about the fragrance and uh, now let's talk about the performance performance wise again no issue here it's a very strong and very long lasting perfume uh, it will again give you uh, 12 plus hours of total longevity and a very strong and solid performance of around four to five hours uh, projection siage is again very good very strong for first two to two and a half hours and of course for the siage it will stay with you until the end of this uh, perfume's life so this was about the performance and now let's talk about gender uh, gender wise this is a unisex perfume uh, but yes with an edge or i can say uh, it's more uh, towards uh, feminine side but even gents they can pull it off easily they can rock it easily so this was about the gender and now let's talk about the age group this is a very versatile perfume and a very easy a very crowd pleasing kind of perfume so i'm sure it can work very well with teenagers uh, with middle aged people and with old people it will work very good anyone can uh, wear this perfume anytime and now let's talk about the season uh, season wise again as i told you it's a virtual perfume you can wear it all year around without any hesitation without any problem and if we talk about the occasions uh, once again you can wear it wherever you want 
in your office, uh, in parties, wherever you like, but especially in the weddings. Uh, if you are going to a wedding, uh, this will work very well with you. Uh, and I think maybe it will not work very well in a club or in a pub, but other than that, uh, you can wear it wherever you want, in the picnics, uh, in your get together with your friends, in uh, any casual or any kind of scenario. So this was about the occasion. And now let's talk about the price. So this perfume comes in 50 ml and the price of this perfume uh, without any discount or offer is 115 dirham. But again, as I have told you, uh, uh, there are a lot of discounts and uh, offers uh, keep coming on the store of Ajmal and on their website. Uh, so you can wait and watch until uh, you get a good discount on this perfume and then you can buy it otherwise it's still it's not very expensive it's just 115 dirham for 50 ml and the quality of the juice is top notch very high quality one of the best from the house of ajmal and this is one of their best sellers so this was a short review about Vesal dahab i hope you like it until the next video take care and bye